Hello everybody, this is Pell-Mell, and as you guys can see, we're doing something a little different today. Um, right now we are starting a new series. Um, this is a CTM map made by LUK3MAN5, or uh, you can call him L5 for short. Um, but he contacted me via YouTube and asked me to beta test this map. Um, and so I decided to, to do it. I thought it'd be something kind of cool and a little bit of variation on my channel. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to try to put these out like once a week. I'm going to try to do about a section per video, but I'd like to limit it to around 20 to 30 minutes. So hopefully we can we can do that. So um, I, the little bit I know about this map is um, it's a follow-up to one of his previous maps, Lucid Realm, uh, the Lucid Realm, which you can download at his website, which I'll have posted in the description. Um, it's a really cool map. I've played some of it, and I would highly, highly recommend it. Um, so I'm really looking forward to this one, but this is called Retribution. So this will be the Retribution series. Um, anyways, let's let's check these signs out. So we have Welcome to Super for Survival Map Six Retribution by LUK Three MAN Five. And let's see here, sequence breaking. Please don't sequence break. It makes me kind of mad at the LPs who bridge over an area. We'll be rewarded for the fun path, so no bridging and tunneling. Okay, let's see. All right, so we don't want to mess with the black box. Okay, wouldn't have done it anyways. All right, let's see, what is this? I don't see anything else kind of glaring out at me in this room, I don't think. I think this is probably what we're supposed to go check out. So it looks like we have some teleporty buttons. Ooh, getting a little bit of lag. All right, and nothing else it looks like. Let me check my time. It's kind of late here, late for me, it's 11.39 in the PM, um, so it's a little little late for me, but uh, so let's try to try to cap it at 30 minutes today. All right, so teleport to Spotlight A. We've got caverns, mazes, and parkour. Okay, I was a little little worried about. That. I suck at parkour. Okay, I'm not looking forward to spot spot Spotlight C. Let's start with A. We'll, we'll go in order. All right. Okay. So I guess we go this way. Anyways, yeah, so I'm kind of excited about this. I've been wanting to do something a little bit different. Um, you know, with my YouTube channel, I really enjoy my my Let's Play. That's kind of cool lighting. I really enjoy my Let's Play, but um, I have been wanting to do some kind of survival map or CTM map. Um, honestly, ever since I watched um, Team Team Canada do um, Ruins of the Minecrackers, I've been really, really interested in CTM maps. So we've got a lot of lava here, and I think I was reading the description of uh, of Retribution. It was really, really cool. I, I probably should have brought that up before I started this. Maybe I'll read you guys a little bit of that. Um, he has like a README file in it, and it's pretty interesting. But uh, yeah, I don't know where I was going with that. I'm kind of tired. <laughs> I actually just got back from a movie. I went out with one of my girlfriends, and um, hey, what's this? And um, we went and saw The Great Gatsby. Girly movie. I know. It was really good. I liked it. Okay, tip. This path is a shortcut. Not the white wool you seek. So we're going to ignore that for now. I'm kind of trying to look around. Um, I know, like, in his the last map I played of his, his, he likes to hide some chests. Hang on, I need a drink of water. But he likes to, to hide some chests, so, um, yeah, we'll be on the lookout for those in dark areas. <laughs> Alright, so we have lots of lava so far. 
Um, but yeah, The Great Gatsby, it was really good if you're into that kind of thing. I think the guy who produced slash directed it was the same guy who did like Romeo and Juliet and um, uh, bu -bu 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 Moulin Rouge. So yeah, expect that kind of thing. All right, fun fact: I had an Elfie play the Lucid Realm, and it turns out that Elfies do not know how to jump onto or on top of ladders. Interesting. So I think another guy who does some of his um, tape, some of his, uh, I can't remember his full name. I'm gonna have to look look at it, but um, I think it's if you go to L5's page. He has, he's like one of the suggested things, you know, suggested YouTubers or, or what have you. Um, but he, uh, he does, he does. And I, I watched one or two of them, but um, yeah, I don't know what that's in reference to. Okay. So I guess Skylight A goes back. Okay, so Burning Sensations. <laughs> that sounds like fun. Yeah. The 12 year old in me is wanting to giggle at that. Okay, I hope you like lava because this area has lots of it. Yo, dog, I heard you like lava. Alright, let's see what we have here. Wow, that's a lot of lava. He wasn't kidding, was he? Oh, 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 oh. You know what? I think I'm supposed to be playing this map on peaceful. Look at that. Glad I didn't notice that. That could have gotten nasty pretty quick. Okay. So we're on peaceful. That was one. A lot of his maps are peaceful maps. To quote all siblings, I told you so. All right. So let's see. We have lots of. How am I supposed to get through this? Seriously? I guess I can jump it. Let's see how this works out. All right. Oh no. That's bad. I'm not going to regen health because my food bar is low because I didn't start on peaceful. Awesome. Alright. That's okay. That's okay. We've got this. Alright. Fire's gone. Oh, I'm regening. I guess you do regen in, in peaceful. Cool. Alright. So we have a ton. So I guess this is like a lava maze or something. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh, hey, we have a sign. And burning. I see burning. Alright, tools that away. Next area is that way. Okay, so let's probably want to get some tools since we have nothing right now. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Let me check my sounds. Hang on. Yeah, that's good. I like to have a little bit of music. I had a comment at one point saying to turn the music to turn the music off, but I like the music. I really enjoy it. It's all part of the gameplay. Now what in the world do we have going on here? So I see absolutely no way if I go down there. I mean I guess I could hop the lava at a couple points, but you know what? We're gonna do this. We're going to go up here. I don't like lava. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, come on. Let's see. Ooh. I think we can fall down there without dying. Oh, yeah. There we go. Ah, we can do it again. Oh, one heart. Peaceful. Psh. Alright, so from what I've heard, even though there's no mobs and we are playing on Peaceful, I've been told not to expect this to be easy. So far it's not horrible. I, I don't want to say that because I don't want to like jinx myself. But, uh... Okay, what is this? I can't jump. Can I jump? I can't survive that kind of fall. So we're going to have to figure out... Yeah, that will kill me. Oh, man. Okay, so I guess... Maybe if we go around that way, it looks like we may be able to fall down. Yeah, we're stuck here. 
fall down there. I'm getting a little bit of lag today. Like, I'm running at 30 F... Okay, it's going up a little bit. Like, I was running at 30 FPS there for a minute, and I usually do a lot better than that. Which right now I'm at 90, so... That's good. Here's another lava jump. Oh, I'm swimming in it. Oh, I'm swimming in it. Oh, that was... That was really bad. That was really close. Alright, I gotta be more careful. I'm gonna wait till this burning thing goes away. I gotta regain some health too. Holy cow, that was close. Alright, I, I have got to be more careful. I cannot die on the white wool. The white wool supposedly is supposed to be like the easy, the easy wool. So if I die on that, Oh, those look like tombstones. Interesting. Alright, so... We want to go around that... That away. See, here's what I'm... How are we going to get back up? I guess we'll have tools, so we should be able to get back up. Ooh. Alright. Feather falling would be nice. Okay. Man, there goes the lag again. What is going on? It must be all this lava. I don't think I have any other... Hang on, let me, uh, you know what? I'm gonna close out this window. I don't think that would be creating an issue, but we will see. Okay. I guess you guys couldn't saw that. I, I see that. So I closed it. I had YouTube up and Twitter up, and I closed it. Alright, we can go down this way. Ouch. Ouch. So today, I did a little work today, I actually got on my, my single player LP and I did some, did a little bit of recording, nothing big, um, let's see what this is, I fixed my chicken farm though, I'm excited to show you guys that, in memory of the maps that L5 abandoned, it's just like a big tombstone, okay, these are tombstones, I guess, in memory of when I cared. <laughs> The unknown beta tester. Dan Amos? Amos? All the enemies. Jorge. Seth Dillard. Interesting. Interesting. There's nothing in those ones. What's this? I see a chest. You guys can't see this. So I'm gonna I'm gonna do this just for you too. Let's see here. Nee, me, nee, me, nee. Even the wicked understand how hard it is to leave. Oh, he gave us sandstone. I guess we can pillar out of here since I guess we did a lot of falling. Those are pressure plates. Why aren't they doing anything? Whoa! I see a sign. Tools and food low. Um, you seeking little grave looter. Yes, I am that poor. You've given me nothing else. You've given me no other choice. L5. Alright, ooh, golden apple. And stone tools. Alright. Let's get out of here. I'm gonna take this with me. Let's not break it with that. Oh, I guess we have an axe, don't we? Oh yeah. You know what, maybe I shouldn't, you know, I, I have no idea when I'm going to have another pickaxe. So let's not waste that one. Okay. Yay, now I can deal with lava easily. I like that. Alright. Sprint, sprint, sprint. Man, the lag. It's got to be this lava. I don't understand this. Maybe I need to restart my computer. It's been a while, I think. Who knows? Anyway, so going back to my chicken cooker, I feel like that's all I've been doing in my single player. 
Let's Play series is my chicken <laughs> It's all been about my chicken cooker. Um, it's, um... Chicken cooker. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, I fixed it today. It finally works. It wasn't working with the lava because the lava was just like straight up killing the chickens without leaving anything behind, any items. So, um, yeah, I went back to flint and steel and I made some changes and I really like it. I'm very happy with it and I'm very excited to show you guys it. Um, I also cleaned up my redstone, which made me very happy because, yeah, it was a mess. And I was kind of embarrassed. It's like a messy house. <laughs> that was my redstone. Oh, this probably wasn't the best way to come, was it? I guess I can. Oh, this lag. What in the world? I mean, if I pillar, that's not like bridging over an area, is it? I don't think I missed anything here. Oh. Sorry, I'm tired. I'm a little... I'm a little loopy right now. I'll admit, the theater I went to served served wine. I may have had a little wine during the movie. I'm okay. I'm not like. I drove home, so I mean, I'm not. Anyways, I was well under under the legal limit. I think I'm just loopy from being tired. All right, so next area. I'm gonna stop talking now. <laughs> um. Okay. So I don't want to jump any more lava because that seems to always end up with me swimming in lava. I don't mind swimming in lava if I have a fire resist potion. Let's go this way, maybe? Maybe not. Maybe this way? This looks better. Alright, the lag is kind of freaking me out a little bit. I usually don't have this much uh, video lag. Alright. It wouldn't be so bad if there wasn't, you know, a ton of lava surrounding me. It's like one, one nice little bit of lag and you're you're swimming. That is that is a lot of lava. There's how is the lava going up? That's interesting. Alright. Um let's go this way. I guess. Whoa. I guess we go up and drop down again. Oh, I see a sign. Um, I will say his Twitter feed in regards to his map says survive. So I'm not, this is paraphr I'm paraphrasing, I'm not quoting. But uh, survive any way you, you can. So uh, yeah, that's me breaking over lava. I hope that's not like breaking the rules. Um, this part looks to me like a sundial, just IMHO, just in my honest opinion. What, this? Or this? That's a lot of lava. That is a lot of lava. And lag. We can fall down here fairly easy. All right, we're down. And we're stuck again. I wonder if we can go behind that. I bet we can go back here. Oh, look at that. Nice little path. Thank you. That was easy. Ish. That was pretty easy. That wasn't terrible. I'm gonna jump it. Ha! <laughs> I made it. <laughs> that's that's the extent of my parkour skills. Just to let you guys know. I think this is a wool thingy. I think we found the white wool. Oh yeah, I bet that's what that is. Come on. 
Oh yeah, white wool. I don't see anything else in there. We found it. So what do we do now? Yes, let's go this way. This way. Let's see what's over here. That room does look kind of cool over there, especially from here. That's pretty neat looking. Oh yeah, here's a doorway thingy. Lag, lag, lag. I gotta figure out why I'm lagging. Hopefully my next episode won't be so laggy. I think it's just probably a matter of restarting the computer. I usually don't have issues. Issues. Let's see. Elfie saw the sign. It opened up his eyes. Ah. You're too young for Ace of Base, dude. Come on. I loved that song in the 90s. It was great. I just skipped over a sign. The fleecy box is free, but you want the tools in the area that the fleecy box is in. Just saying. Is that these? Are you talking about my stone tools? Did I get them? I didn't see any other chests. I'm guessing we got them. So fleecy box, I guess that's the thing the wool was in. Okay. Lots of lava. I'm seeing I'm seeing a theme here, guys. Alright, let's see. Ah, uh, burning sensations. That's just where we came from. Doom fall sinkhole. Onward march and spotlight B. Isn't that sign up there irritating your O C D L five? Hee hee, what's on? Intersection one? Is that it? Is that it? Anyways, um, okay, so we've done Burning Sensation. Doom Falsing Cold sounds amazing, but, uh, yeah, not really. So let's go to Onward March. Um, I think we have, we've only been at this for about 20 minutes. I'm going to go on a little more and see, I don't know. Oh. I see sapling. Oh, okay, here's the monument. Okay, good deal. So we're at the monument. So this is probably... Let's explore this, and I think this will be a good stopping point. I think so. What do we have here? Intersection 2, 3, and 4. Near-death scenarios. Awesome. That sounds like a whole lot of fun. Buff station. Wood times 16. I'll take that. And nobody to me explained why this block is not helpful. Nobody to me explained why this block is not helpful. Uh, no, whoops. Nobody to me. That that hurts my head to read that sentence. All right. Well, let's just keep the sapling from not growing. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we'll have a tree. Uh, let's see. P.S. More dirt can be found in intersection 3. Awesome. Let's go ahead and save here for the night. Since it is night. Set our home here. We've got lots of coal in the wall. That's good. Uh, teleport to location blank. Hmm. Hmm. Your last chance? What's my last chance? Go to Wagoneer Cavern at intersection 2 to understand the obsidian. Hmm. Oh. I got a message. Seriously, don't you trust me, mate? I'm more dangerous in this game than TNT. Alright, so he doesn't want us to trust him. Here's the monument that we need to complete. So it looks like we have... Uh, let's go ahead and put our white wool down. So it looks like we have lots of wool colors. Welcome to the wool observatory. Lots of wool colors. This must be the bonus. Second red wool obsidian block. Emergency exit. What does that even mean? Elfie's head. Chloe's head. Elfie's head. We've got ender chest. Nice lag. Nothing in there yet. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's throw some of this wood in there. Just in case. Cause I have a feeling. I have a feeling. 
Oh man, that lag. What in the world? I've got to figure that out. I hate video lag more than anything. Like, it will irritate me in a heartbeat if I'm playing <laughs> a game and there's video lag. Emergency exit, a way to stop the glitch in vanilla MC. Let's see what this is about. Okay, there's some leather pants. Emergency eggs. Oh, okay, so there must be some kind of potion. Let's see, uh, good day, players. Oh, five pages. Let me just read through this real fast, and I'll give you guys a synopsis. Oh, okay, so if you, like, glitch into a block or fall into void, I guess this potion will, uh, you will burn, will not, I will not burn, um, oh, emergency exit, this must be, you know what, here's what we're going to do with this, so I think this potion will teleport you back to spawn, if you, like, mess up, start falling into the void or something, but you know what, we're not going to do that, we're going to go ahead and throw this thing on the monument, bam, there we go. Let me go put this book back. I'll just throw it right here. So I think that's probably um, good for now, I guess. Oh, that lag is going to drive me crazy. I think this is probably a good stopping point. Um, whoa, we're going super fast. Oh man, look at that jump. Um, he had something like this in the Lucid Realm too. Jumps crazy. Anyways, um, like I said, I think this is a good time to go ahead and call it an episode. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'm looking forward to uh, doing another one of these. It's been kind of fun so far. I'm excited to see, you know, what else what else he has in store. Um, anyways, I hope you guys have a good evening. Bye.